This mailman disappeared every fortnight for 34 years, but now the truth has finally come out. When he was a teenager, Marco Perez received an important postcard that would save hundreds of people's lives. From that day on, every fortnight, he would disappear for two hours to undertake a very important errand. And when he hit a significant landmark, everyone would learn what his secret mission had been for the past 34 years. Perez lives in San Antonio, Texas, and he's worked as a mailman in the area for the past 27 years. But the 57-year-old didn't have the easiest of starts to life. He was born prematurely, in fact, and required a blood transfusion in order to survive. When I was growing up, my dad told me a friend of his donated blood for me. Perez subsequently recalled in an interview with KENS 5 Eyewitness News. His name was Mr. Aguilar. He took the time to donate, so he saved my life. It's a gesture that Perez has never forgotten. Perez and Angular remain friends to this day, in fact. Moreover, when Perez's dad passed away a year ago, Aguilar stepped up and took on a more of a fatherly role to the mailman. And it turned out that in Perez's teenage years, he found a secret way to express his gratitude towards the man who'd saved his life as a baby. One day, the then teenage Perez received an important postcard that would inadvertently save hundreds of lives. The postcard was from a blood bank, and they were looking for volunteers to make donations. Knowing what Aguilar had done for him, Perez consequently decided to step forward. Perez soon headed to the South Texas Blood and Tissue Center, STBTC, to find out how to donate blood. And when he was accepted and realized how easy it was, Perez went all in. He learned that it wasn't a one-off procedure and that he could continue making donations. So he did. Since that day, in fact, Perez's mission has been to donate blood as often as he can. So he's been returning to the blood bank for the past 34 years. Over time, of course, that amounted to a lot of blood, and eventually he hit an incredible milestone. In July of 2017, Perez became one of only a handful of people in South Texas to have donated 100 gallons of blood in their lifetime. Moreover, the feat was accomplished by making a very specific donation. It's one that allows him to make donations more frequently than other ways of giving blood. Perez donates blood platelets. It's a method only available at certain Red Cross donation centers across America and is not an option at drop-in blood drives. It was thankfully on offer to Perez at his local blood donation center and he's used the same method for 34 years. This particular method involves only the platelets being extracted from the bloodstream, while the rest of the blood is returned to the body. The resulting yield can provide enough stock for two or three patients, the equivalent of what would normally be collected from five orthodox donations. The process allows for a donor to make more donations throughout the year compared to more conventional blood donation methods. In Perez's case, he was able to make 24 trips a year to the STBTC compared to the more usual six. Platelets must be used within five days of donation. However, far less than six weeks for typical blood donations. Still, this short time span tends not to be a problem as it's estimated that someone in the U.S. is in need of platelets every 30 seconds. That equates to around one million transfusions a year. Platelets are in high demand then, particularly among cancer patients. While undergoing cancer treatment, a patient will experience a significant drop in the number of platelets in their blood as a side effect. They aid in blood clotting, so platelet transfusions can prove life-saving for cancer patients. Platelets also assist those recovering from major surgeries and anyone who has undergone a transplant. So, with such high demand, Perez's contribution made a big impact. The STBTC, in fact, estimates that the mailman has helped to save the lives of more than 1,500 people. STBTC Corporate Communications Specialist Roger Ruiz told KENS5, Mr. Perez is what you consider an all-star for the blood community here in South Texas. He's probably saved patients going through cancer treatments, patients who have been in car accidents, 
patients who have blood disorders. As Perez celebrated his 100 gallon mark, he stressed the importance of platelet donation. They might live an extra day, a year, a month, who knows, he told KENS5. Maybe they'll live forever. Somebody needs these platelets and there's no platelets on the shelf. Perez's own donation amounts to around two and a half gallons a year. He's among four all-star donors at the center who have donated in excess of 100 gallons of blood in their lifetimes. Among them is a fellow postal worker as well as a donor who has surpassed 115 gallons and another close to the 120 gallon milestone. For Perez, donating is simple and it's this simplicity that he emphasizes in order to encourage others to donate. If you make time to go eat, you make time to go to the movies, you can make time to come donate, he told KENS5. Just make some time. Give from the heart. That's what it takes. You gotta give from the heart. Blood banks constantly need to replenish their stocks. As Perez has proven, you're never too young or too old to contribute. As he told KENS5 regarding his own donations, don't cost me a dime, only some time. I'm 57 and I've already got 100 gallons. These other people are in their 70s or 80s. Perez then has no plans to stop making his bi-weekly visits to the STBTC to donate platelets. There's a lot of sick people out there that we don't know about, he told Inside Edition. I'll just keep donating until the blood bank says I can't donate anymore. It's just giving, showing love for a fellow human being.